All right, welcome back yeah. to Off the Wire, everybody. Our next guest is a world-renowned chef. She had an amazing performance on this past season of Top Chef Masters and recently partnered with Taco Bell to create the new Cantina Bowl. Everyone, please welcome Lorena Garcia. Hi, Hi. 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 Hello, wow. <laughs> this is awesome. I love to be here. All right. Oh, Hello, you am. How are you guys? <laughs> it's our homecoming. It's wow, our this is so awesome. You have a date here. yet? I figure you have quite a few. <laughs> will, will you go with me? Of course. Actually, let's um, do it. <laughs> I was wondering if you could. I know Mitt Romney has one, so I started one. Could you join oh, my, this is your list. My, my binder of women? I was wondering if you could. I don't know. Be the first to. I guess I'm gonna be the other woman book. now. <laughs> the problem. Just, just the first page is fine. Okay, of course, of course. So yeah. should I sign in? Yeah, just sign Number in. Number one. Uh, the date and the time. Okay, there you yeah. go. <laughs> yeah, that works. There. Thank you. All right, great. Um, so how did you get into cooking? How did I get into cooking? Wow. I remember the first time that I cooked. I was about seven years old, and. Uh, this is Burn what I did. Down. Yeah, yeah. It, no, no, almost. Oh, okay. So I, I put a picnic right in the middle of the living room. Mm -hmm. I did breakfast, put it on the floor literally, and called my, my parents to come into the living room and do, and do like a picnic. So that was the first time. Did that they, was it a surprise? Did they know it was happening? Yeah, they said, what, what is this, Lorena? What are you doing? Well, we ended up having I breakfast made on the loops. floor. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. All right. Um, so um, the Cantina Bowl yes. is a big deal. I had one the other day. Delicious. Have you guys? <laughs> <laughs> uh, how, d how did you, you're working with, um, with Taco Bell, how did, how did you um, get to come up with that and how did you make something that was, you know, like, s that someone could replicate in, right. in the re regular restaurant? Right, right. Well, this is a process that, that took like two years, mm -hmm. you know, the, the first time that I went to Taco Bell. And I was a little bit confused because I, I, I to be completely honest, I don't mm -hmm. go to fast food restaurants and I never was in Taco Bell before, so mm -hmm. I was a little bit, well, why are these people calling me? I come from restaurants, gourmet, and now yeah. Taco Bell fast food. And now they make a, a shell out of Doritos. Yeah, so I, I was <laughs> yeah, I was like, I didn't make the connection, but you know what, yeah. after after being there, and they asked, Lorena, we need help. We need mm -hmm. help with the food, with ingredients. What would you do different, and how can you help us? And I'm like, hey, you know, I'm all about the food, I'm all about the ingredients. So I started by simplifying the process right. and creating a recipe and creating a, a menu item that was easy to execute. Once mm -hmm. you make it easier, once we are in all the 6,000 restaurants, then it's a little bit better. 6,000? 6,000 wow. restaurants. Wow. You know, do you know that 40% of the population go to eat at these restaurants every day? Every day? Every day. That's huge. That's, that's <laughs> too much. That's a lot. Yeah. <laughs> that's a lot. Yeah. Um, <laughs> did you... Have you ever eaten someone else's version of your cantina bowl? You know, yes, I have. Like a regular this, this is what I do, bowl. right? So I go through drive through okay. so nobody knows, right, that I'm actually yeah. the one ordering it. <laughs> so I, I'm with my camera and my, you know, you know with, a, with, a, with a little camera and my phone, just shooting it out and see, yeah. you know, and th so far, so good. Have you Everybody ever stepped into the well. kitchen and, like, you I know. did. You know, the other day I went to the Taco Bell. I have a Taco Bell right in my corner, right, and the corner of my office. So I walked in and I said, okay, for the time that it's going to take me to eat, a cantina bowl, mm -hmm. everybody eats it for free. So everybody was like going crazy, you know, <laughs> ordering the bowl. What That's are you doing thing. immediately after this? What it, probably going to Taco Bell. All right. <laughs> <laughs> um, so you, you were, um, you've been studying all over the world for, for your cooking. Um, yes. What country uh, did, you, did you get the most from learning to bring I, to your own? I, yes, I love the southern part of Italy, mm -hmm. Capri, Sorrento. Vico, all this part of South, South Italy that really uh, pays attention to seafood and light sauces mm -hmm. and olive oil and you know different garlics, it's just amazing. So I think uh, that's one of my favorites. Oh, who, d who, did, who did you work with there? Is it like a, a you were in a famous restaurant? I did. Mm -hmm. I work in different places. Mm -hmm. The last time that I went, I worked with Genaro Esposito. He has three stars Michelin. Oh, I know him. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I don't know. Just kidding, right? <laughs> but, I, but I'd assume among like the the big the, the chef world, he's uh, he's not such an obscure reference. He's like a you know. Uh, yeah, he's very yeah. very well known because he makes just you know soul Italian cuisine to mm -hmm. the high level. So you know it's a very nice combination of high cuisine with just pure classic Italian dishes. So fantastic. Uh, what's what's your favorite dish to make? My 
pair. This is almost like asking a, a parent, which kid do you love more? <laughs> but <laughs> there is a favorite. <laughs> <laughs> Can I say uh, I, I love grilling? Mm -hmm. Love a beautiful steak or a beautiful roasted chicken. I'm into very simplistic but well done food. Yeah, like the cantina bowl. So, um, cilantro is your thing. Yes, it is. I love it. You know, my mother growing up, I love soups. I love stews. And she always used to put, at the end, a little bit of cilantro on pretty mm. much everything that she, that she made. So it, it calls to my Latin cuisine. It calls to the way that I was growing up. And I always liked that sense. So I just happen to love it. I, I really think either you love it or you hate it. I happen to love it. <laughs> All right. Uh, well, yeah. we'll be right back uh, with more Lorena Garcia. Woo!